This is your no bullshit review of Legion. What can I say about Legion? Well, this is a collaboration between Jim Beam and Suntory, uh, where they go through and they both kind of do something to it. So they do something over in America, and then the guys over in Japan do something to it, put in different casks and whatnot. You can look at the story if you want online. And what I gotta say about this, get it. It is super unique in a good way for $42. 94 proof. I think this is a fabulous value, a change of pace, and something you should definitely try. So what do I wrote down for this? Very complex, savory. I wish it was at 100 proof. Upfront punch. Dances on the taste buds for a while. That's what I got for this. I do like it. I like it enough that I actually went out and got another bottle. Actually, I'll be honest, I accidentally got it. Forgot I had the other bottle, but now I'm glad I do. So, let's get to the numbers. As far as this goes, sweetness 8.2. It is a uh, rather sweet and smoky at a 5.3. Harshness 4.5. It does have a punch up front, but it mellows out. And uh, we got a one for floral. Complexity is a 7.5. This is very complex. There's a lot going on with it. Um, unique in a different way. I'm gonna talk about one it reminds me of that also is very unique. Body 6.1, nice oily, heavy viscous. Um, you know, not overly, but rather, you know, a good amount of body to it. Value, I have a six. It's unique in a good way. Um, you know, for $42, this is well worthy of a purchase over many other uh, bottles of bourbon that are out there. What it reminds me of is Old Milk's, <laughs> Old Milk, Old Elk Sour Mash Reserve. Uh, this is a $100 bottle, $90 bottle. Um, it's a little higher proof, but it's also unique. It reminds me of it. Not saying it's exactly like it, but it reminds me of it. And then also, uh, Smoke Wagon, uncut and unfiltered. That's what it reminds me of, right there. And those are two unique in, in my, uh, you know, tastings. Uh, these are two very unique bourbons, and that's what Legion Kai reminds me of um, in its own unique way. So if you've had this, go ahead and put in the comments down below what you think of it, what your uh, you know taste buds tell you, if you think it's a value or not, and uh, I think you should definitely give it a try if you have not. So if you guys have any questions or anything, let me know, and until next time, later.